Welcome to the CTV News Channel. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the hottest news of the day. Our newsletter today includes the following. When actors get sick of their movie image, despite revulsion, endure. Acting is more difficult than most people imagine. It is well known that performers are often required to alter their appearance in order to portray a character they are playing. Some individuals enjoy it, while others aren't so sure. For as long as a few months to several years, they must maintain the same image. These actors had no choice but to stick it out until the end of the film. Chris Evans Chris Evans reportedly had to put on 9 to 13 kilograms to play Steve Rogers in Captain America and the Avengers. Upon completion of filming, the actor exclaimed, Oh my gosh, when I finished filming, I stopped coming to the gym for three months. Also, Chris Evans has shed roughly 7 kilograms and no longer has to worry about his appearance e as much as he used to. Emma Watson when she was playing Hermione Granger in Harry Potter, Emma Watson wore her hair long. Emma Watson had to sign a contract stating that she would not trim her hair for the next number of years a streak of nine consecutive years. After nearly a decade of not changing her haircut, Emma decided to take a risk after finishing the movie. The pixie hairstyle looks like that. As a matter of fact, I've wanted to cut my hair since I was a teenager. When Harry Potter was finished, I went right away to finish it, as the actress revealed. Tom Felton Tom Felton, like Emma Watson, had to adopt the look of Draco Malfoy for the duration of his time in the Harry Potter films. As a result, the actor has to bleach his hair frequently and avoid exposure to the sun. Tom Felton was overjoyed when the filming was completed and he could go back to his original skin tone and hair color. For the first time in my life, I don't think I'll ever have to put sunscreen on or wear an umbrella with three hats while on vacation. Miley Cyrus is a fourth-generation pop star. Miley Cyrus was not allowed to clip her hair while filming Hannah Montana. Her stylist cut it into a short bob and bleached it for her as she was waiting for the movie to end in 2011. Miley Cyrus trimmed her pixie short after only a few months and told her hairdresser, cut it short and tint it blonde for me I'm ready for a shift, she declared. Mila Kunis, 5th. When Mila Kunis was cast in Black Swan as a professional female ballet dancer, she shed a significant amount of weight. For seven months, Mila worked four hours a day, seven days a week, with only one and a half days off. Mila shed nine kilograms, yet her physique is now as flat as a mirror. There is nothing slick or shaped like anything, as Mila put it. It just took five days after she finished, the part before she was back to her pre-roll size. Leighton Meester When filming Gossip Girl, the actress had to keep her hair long, and brown dyed. After the end of Gossip Girl, Leighton Meester revealed that she had cropped her long hair. What do you think? It's time to move on. Robert Pattinson. Vampire Robert Pattinson had to grow a beard for a several parts throughout his acting career. And it's a given that the actor isn't happy about it. I'm in awe at how quickly it's expanding. I was overjoyed that I was able to get rid of it. It's repulsive enough to make you gag just thinking about it. The movie he was in, The Lost City of Z, ended in October, and by November he had gotten off his beard. Jamie Dornan. Jamie Dornan, unlike Robert Pattinson, enjoys growing a beard. The actor was not happy when he was required to shave for 50 shades of grey. It's a fact that I despise my beardless appearance. After the first season finished in February, the actor promptly reappeared in April sporting a beard. Jamie Dornan, however, had to give up his beloved beard for the second film.